Welcome to Tech Brothers with Damir. In this video, we are going to learn how to get the record count for all the tables in MySQL database. Um, so think about that. We have a database called Tech Brothers IT, and there are some tables in this uh, database. Uh, we have customer and customer one table. Uh, now, if I would like to get uh, the count for that, uh, some of the places I have seen that people are saying, go ahead and select uh, the information uh, from information schema dot tables, uh, and uh, there is a column called uh, table rows that will give you some information. Okay, and uh, Again, uh, I'm telling you, this is not going to give you the exact uh, rows. Uh, you might have deleted, inserted, updated a lot of records uh, in those tables. Uh, and uh, this does not provide you the exact information. So here, if you see that uh, it is only returning me the records for customer 1. Uh, it's not even returning me record count for the customer okay uh, sorry just for customer now if I go back here and I will uh, just uh, simply use select count start from that table that give me the count from that table as well so you can see that uh, the customer table has 110 rows uh, but this uh, information schema dot tables did not provide us the accurate information so um, the changes ha has happened but they are not written to the engine or they're in cache and they are not really updated for the system databases so that that's one of the reason that possibility like okay you are getting the wrong count okay let's uh, take a look on the count of the customer one so you see that even for customer one we have only five records and uh, the our uh, system uh, databases is shown us uh, we have 115 rows um, so if you really need to get the correct uh, count from each of the table in the database in mysql or mariadb i will not suggest using them um, information schema dot tables um, okay so what you need to do you need to use the select count star from each of the table um, okay that's good but if you have 100 table then you will be creating this uh, statement um, so you can uh, use this above script uh, what i'm providing here to generate the uh, so, uh, count uh, statements. Um, so you see that right here. So I'm saying uh, select a customer as a table name plus count. Uh, and uh, you can take this uh, output, uh, just control C, paste it here or in the new window and run it. Uh, okay, remove this last union. You don't need this. Um, okay, fine. So we run this statement now. And you can see that it provides you the list of the columns and also provide you the count from each of the table. So I will suggest uh, use uh, this uh, count star from that table that will give you accurate count of the records in that uh, table. And to generate the statements for all of the tables, you can use uh, this uh, script. Remember, when you generate the script, the last statement also has union. So remove that. We don't need the, the last union. So and from the last row, remove the union and then run all of them together it will give you one uh, nice output uh, so you can also copy and put in excel or whatever for analysis uh, thanks very much for watching this video and i hope this will help uh, help i will see you guys in next video